what? Maybe the Spring Mountain Range might use that snowblower that you have there, Todd, because we have got snowfall falling all since early this morning, really late last night, and we're continuing to drop the snowfall level. It looks like it's around 5,000 feet or so, and it's getting very close to that Red Rock Loop and getting on to the hump to Pahrump as well. Also monitoring the shower activity. It's been a light drizzle here across Las Vegas, mainly associated to other uh, Summerlin area, Centennial Hills, but then dropping down towards the south, Enterprise getting on into uh, closer to around the M Resort. Uh, you're looking at uh, seeing some light drizzle activity as well, but uh, really damp roads all over the Las Vegas region today and most of Southern Nevada. It's associated with that front, that low pressure system that we've been monitoring, but it looks like it linked up with our massive jet stream that we have, and it's following that kind of pattern as it goes through the United States. So this is going to dip towards the south, getting on into New Mexico, pushing on into Dallas, and then it's going to be up around uh, the St. Louis area into the New England region if it continues this track, uh, just like what we have for the jet stream here. So what we're going to deal with today is a little bit of the wet stuff for your morning commute and then getting into some cloud cover for the rest of your day. A little bit of light wind, but the temperatures, ugh, I wish they could say they're going to be a lot better than this, but they're not going to be by much. 47 degrees right now within Las Vegas. Definitely sweater weather, 38 per rump, 44 Henderson, about 45 to Boulder City. As we go through the day, we'll see a little bit of sunshine moving on into your drive home, but 57 degrees is going to be the high temperature for central Las Vegas. That is it. Average high for this time of year, about 60, 61 degrees. So we're below it already, and we continue to plummet these temperatures moving into the next couple of days. With that being said, the winds are going to pick up by late tonight and then pushing on into your Tuesday and your Wednesday. We're talking gusts between 25 and 35 miles per hour. 57 degrees the high today. We're going to drop temperatures to 56 on Tuesday, 55 on Wednesday, and it's going to feel like the 40s thanks to that wind. So bundle up. It's chilly out there.